bodies are still in there, all mummified and stuff. Perhaps your magical mask can relieve us of this senseless searching. Will you stop calling it that? Super valuable. There it is! Lady Hellbender's fortress! It's gotten bigger, that's for sure! Ha! It is not getting bigger! We are getting closer! Looks like there's a way down here! Well, You gotta see this! Sit down, or... or... Oh, uh, uh, uh. I got some power-ups over here, so I'm gonna... Bad. Okay, let's go back. I can hear you down never realized that was such a hot spot for the war. Everywhere was a hot spot for the war. Okay, yeah. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's slimy. Uh, yes. Come down here. <laughs> oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam voice? <clears throat> you think? Some smack breach! The sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, it fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking and jelly here. <laughs> well, do something! Like what? <laughs> Quill? Quill? 
I don't want him on me. My blasts, they I only done that once before when I was a kid. I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, it pulls Scud like this. I guess, come on, you just leave the guns me, alone. Me, I, I, Quill, I just want to see how they tick. Otherwise, it might as well be magic or sorcery. Guys, DNA code in the box. Some kind of morph in an or sorcery. Here we go again. As am I, assassin. So perhaps he wants you out of my way. I am brute. Or maybe he wants you to sit back and watch so you can learn from a pro. You think we're in trouble from these guys? Well, I say trouble is our middle name. Who said we were in trouble? When we're slicing scuts with a knife or a blade? When we're shooting fast and Groot's making shade? That's what I call trouble. Who's with me? Do his Wait, a so much the leader, up and over. Ding, ding, ding. Give that man a gold star. Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. Be a planetary. Right, Gamora? No way. Wonder if we can get Drax. Think you can drag this cannon out? I will try. It is... More stubborn than expected! Impossible! We'll not stay in place! Couldn't just hold it for a while longer? 
You try holding it for a while longer. We've got to find a way to lock it in. Drax, can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. I can't hit it! Impressive, Peter Quill. Now we gotta get the next one out. Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. Oh, what reeks in here? That's... Oh, Scott. Ah. Are you okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat that Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute the little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what? Flark it. I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on! Think about all the booby traps and... Ha! Look at it go! He must have jump-started the thing. Mark, you okay? <laughs> yeah! And dry now, too! Gamora, can you clear us a path through that junk? <laughs> sure. Yes, Peter Quill! Onward to the palace of the great giantess! Oh, man! Another murder tentacle! Careful. It might be playing dead. That is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Back to its brood mother, Lady Hellbender. Oh. Come on. Why is the bridge always on the wrong side? This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! You are dead! Dead! How many times do I have to say it? We're not throwing rocket. Ridiculous. You were holding us back to spare the beast's feelings. When has he done the same for us? Put him down. This be a lesson to you. Oh, I'll show you what a lesson looks like! Knock it off, guys! We're supposed to be professionals. We're better than this. I'm not. Letting a measly Chitauri installation stop our progress is unprofessional. Then stop wasting time arguing. We'll find another way across. I used to believe that the rodent had the most impressive firearm in our group. Fortress is this way, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just doing some exploring. Ain't we done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is code. It means he went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. In that case, Quill's the greatest explorer I ever met. See my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. Take his word for what? He says the soil here is like supercharged with plant Getting a little bit of a buzz just walking on it. Oh. Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver if something should attack. We're not gonna be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. 
Oh, anybody else smell that? He stinks back here. Yes, it smells putrid. Where is it coming from? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, not talking. <gasps> not even breathing. I wonder if there's a common monster hunter uniform. Like, are they organized, or maybe even just a style? Who would adorn themselves with the fangs and teeth of their prey. Yep, definitely something gross behind here. Drax, can you chuck that through the stink wall? I fear I will regret this. Huh? That is disturbingly fragrant. After you. Ugh. Ugh. I am clenching every orifice right now. Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Okay, that got my uh, blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Uh, because it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter! Why would it taste like that? We can use this. You know, we really got Monster gotta food? Your taste the cage! You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress. With our monster peacefully walking beside us, we'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you whispering? Gamor uh, thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety as leader.
They seem to be really hurt. Really hurt this guy. Right with you, big guy. Oh, cool. Thank you, Peter Quill. Sure. Oh, slice him up. Go get him, Tiger. You are coming with me. We better hurry. Oh, first rain, then jelly, then slimy, stinky crawl spaces, and now all these monsters. I hate this flarking planet! You hate everything, Rocket. True, but especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Hey, we're a team. If we're gonna smell like butt, we're gonna smell like butt together. That is most eloquent, Peter Quill. I will smell like butt with you. Yeah, really great speech. So, when are the rest of us gonna get jet boots? It takes years of special training to operate these things. You had years of jet boot lessons. No. But the guy I took them off of did. You stole them. He was dead. Blew into a ceiling fan. Groot says we should check things out over here. Groot, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. Oh, Seknarf ain't never heard of roads. You'd have to clear parts of the jungle to do it, which would probably mean killing some of the wildlife. Good. They deserve it. Seknoff 9 is a sanctuary. They say that if you leave behind a single piece of refuse, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you in the most unpleasant way. That can't be true. Heavy quilt. Surprisingly light. If we put our monster in it, will he shrink as well? Uh, no. It would compress anything inside to a mound of twitching gore. <laughs> Neat. Don't get any ideas. Here. We need to make a profit this time. Hey, well, better not forget what we talked about earlier. It's nothing. Don't worry, Rocket. Whoa, that is definitely in my top ten fortresses. Ticking time bomb on the ship. You just can't catch a break. There's always some stupid blah monster or angry space copter. A random ship exploding, kicking us in the teeth. And the weather always sucks. It does. Uh... Let's just get this done. Okay. Let's 
farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a fork in infinity bridge, is what it is. Are uh, you being dramatic, Rodent? Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. In cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you Oh, right. The cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like we mean business. Groot, you ready to squeeze in? Aye. Peter Quill, there's still time to reconsider. The tree creature is not very monstrous. Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Rock is the best escape artist I know. Things go south after the transaction. We're making the right choice. What? We voted on this. I don't feel right putting Groot in a cage. That's because it ain't right. Peter, She'll he... go for it. I think he's made his point. <laughs> Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as our leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. I am Groot. When you stop worrying so much, you're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. someone else wants to pull this thing. We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. 0 0.6 clicks. clicks. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. Gotta beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. Oh, that was fast. Give me a sec. I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I liked your singing. Well, you might be the only one. 
Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Out. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I wanna go see Night of the Cosmos at the Real tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on, it's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13, and I'm 13. Exactly. PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like... Butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was... I know! You were... Standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No, of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about, something I want to give you. 20 bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. 